last bit of news before we head out, before I go out for a run, actually. Um, Kanye has linked up with Gap. Kanye has announced a 10-year, or well, yeah, 10-year deal with Gap. Um, he's essentially, you know, lived up to his promise of doing a collaboration with Gap and wanting to, sorry, wanting to design for Gap, you know, a promise or a goal that he had in mind for himself where he went to... Um, design on the biggest platform possible essentially drag uh gap into the 21st century drag them back into the popular co modern co oh yeah the current conversation when it comes to fashion um it's an incredible and incredible incredible partnership and again for a brand that no one was talking about thinking about you know two weeks ago to suddenly be you know on the lips of everybody is a genius move and again aligning themselves with yeezy yeezy then going out and hiring a whole bevy of you know the who's who in talent to kind of lead that charge is amazing so let's go through how it announced um kanye tweeted which he hasn't done in a while even throughout the whole black lives matter issue and the protests that's happening all across north america he has remained mute and essentially spoke um with action you know contributed mad millions to charities and organizations he went and marched on the streets of chicago he's just been dealing with things a lot better than he did when he was going through that whole debacle with trump and calling him daddy and stuff right he's essentially learned his lesson i think if that's a right way to go about it right um but yeah it's a it's a good thing so he essentially put this tweet out earlier in the day that said worst worst day ever with a picture of a person kneeling over zipping up a bag that essentially has a gap written on it which is what people spot it was a gap collaboration a sort of tote bag with a nice duffel coat i'm assuming it looks like um red bomber jacket sort of padded coat the iconic blue hoodie that he said was a perfect hoodie remember Tr um sorry trump remember when kanye west had an interview with i think wall street with journal and he said that he was developing the perfect hoodie he was you know perfecting this perfect hoodie in his idea with the perfect hem sizes the perfect hood the perfect pouch pocket and he essentially wanted to first collaborate i'm assuming it was with walmart or costco that was the first sort of thing he wanted to do but now he's got the opportunity to provide that same perfect hoodie to the masses um using the outlet such as gap and then it finishes off that look with some khaki pants and i don't know if that's a shirt that's being thrown in there on the left of the screen but it looks in purple and lilac so immediately you see the color palette is completely different to what he's doing at yeezy there's a lot more bright colors there the tones are a bit more vibrant and obviously now going to the second announcement when you look at the team it makes a lot of sense right Right. Um, he's essentially uh, put together a small team uh, precisely for this collab multi-year collaboration and he has uh, got together with the likes of if it comes up here on the screen bu -bu 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 -bu. oh that's a logo for Yeezy and Gap as well uh, taking the iconic uh, Gap logo and flipping it with the Yeezy symbol and then lastly he announced the lineup of who is actually going to be part of it let's go back to his twitter profile actually here boom get that back on the screen there it's on here but the team as well sort of reflects the vibrant nature of the collaboration they said yeezy gap begins all caps uh mawala so mawala mawalola joins as Yeezy Gap um, Design Director. And if you're a fan of um, ex-CSM graduates or whatever it may be, definitely check out her work. She's got a really cool interview in Days, actually, a feature that I read a while back that was really good. Um, again, loads of bright colors, um, loads of interesting materials. So I'm interested to see what they're going to be doing on the material front in terms of textures or whatever. Um, there's also announcements for the Kids See Ghost cartoon done by Murakami and Cuddy. There's going to be a Jesus is King film on Apple directed by James Terrell, it looks like. There's going to be a Yeezy Supply doc documentary directed by nick knight there's going to be a phone runner released um, made entirely in the us which i'm really looking forward to that phone runner looks amazing it's my ideal sandal not really a fan of sandals and then jesus king um dr dre version is coming out which is going to be impeccable and the wash us in your blood video by alpha jaffa so an incredible lineup of stuff that he's putting out sort of done it in like a tesla in like an elon musk tesla way you know very direct very to the point <clears throat> and then we have an article here from new york times essentially telling us what the actual crack is with the whole issue I'll quickly read that for you and then we'll head off but yeah i think it's good news man it's great to see kanye back um doing these kind of like mass collaborations you know touching people with his design uh prowess in this platform i think is pro is amazing so this is from new york times it says kanye west and gap strike a 10-year deal for the yeezy gap apparel line 
this is yeah and it says here the gap brand which has uh, flared in recent years has uh, struggled with identity crisis has a new idea for how to revive its fortunes kanye west the retailer is partnering with mr west and yeezy his fashion company for a new clothing line called yeezy gap that will be introduced in the first half of 2021 the company said on friday um yeezy design studio under mr west creative direction plans to create modern elevated basics for men women and kids and accessible price points mr west design vision will extend to the, how the fashion line will be showcased in gap stores online that'd be amazing to see so a complete overhaul right of how they present their, their garments and if you've been to gap too you know that they've got some pieces in there but the way the store is merchandise is oof, it makes you think you should never shop in there but they've, they've actually got some pieces honestly um it continues um gap is making a far bigger bet on mr yeezy and mr west a celebrity crave entrepreneur rapper and designer than a typical designer collaboration they agreed a 10-year deal starting this month with the option to renew after five years according to a person familiar with the negotiation who is not authorized to speak publicly um at the five-year point gap is hoping the yeezy gap will be generating one billion in annual sales which is probably going to happen it's, imagine seeing gaps at imagine seeing queues out outside of gap around the world amazing isn't it the, the fucking power this guy has is incredible uh, it says for context gap's brand bought in 4.6 billion globally in revenue right so imagine if he's able to surpass that just through his own little capsule collection um gap did not respond to requested a comment <clears throat> it comes as gap inc which also owns Old Navy and Banana Republic, aims to refocus its namesake brand, which has been which has seen sales plummet in the past few years, closed more than 100 North American stores and struggles to redefine its place within the apparel industry. It, like other brands, has also had a badly hit by coronavirus pandemic. Mrs. West, who worked at Gap as a teen, which is incredible, you know, way to kind of bring things around full circle has expressed deep interest in the brand for years declaring in a 2015 interview that he would like to be the steve jobs of the gap and once dreamed of being the head creative director he has visited the san francisco headquarters and met with art peck gaps um former chief executive the gap deal will fulfill a desire of mrs west to make clothing for the masses even as yeezy has become a persist a presence in new york and paris fashion weeks yeezy merchandise on farfetch recently included a 950 dollar 925 dollar graphic card and a 241 dollar women's thermal sweater at gap jeans and tops often cost less than 50 dollars and are regularly discounted gap will pay royalties and potential equity to mr yeezy wow miss west sorry which um is solely owned by West based on sales and performance. Mr. West has successfully partnered with Adidas since 2013, where his brand has positioned as its own category and he earns royalties on net sales of his shoes and apparel, the New York Times reported last June. Each of shoes, which cost hundreds of dollars and even more on secondary market, were expected to top 1.3 billion sales last year. Mamma mia, man. Incredible, man. What a come up for Kanye. What an absolute come up. And again, I can't wait to see <clears throat> what that collection looks like. Um, so far, the one picture already gives me hope it's going to be absolutely banging. For sure. For sure, there's going to be Elves Court. But I guess with it being in Gap, it's going to be an option for us to all get a piece of it. Um, I'm, I'm excited. I can't wait to see what the future lies in terms of Gap and Yeezy. So, I don't know. Watch this space, I guess. Keep an eye on the social medias. Someone will tell you. Someone will tell you.